Hi, Ali here again. I'm in the African Rainforest Pavilion where our gorillas live. And I'm just going to talk to you a little bit today about enrichment, behavioral enrichment for our gorillas. Gorillas typically in the wild are herbivores and they spend the majority of their day foraging for food as well as sleeping. Um, and so they have sort of this cyclical behavior where they will eat and forage and then they have a bit of a nap to help digest the very high fiber foods that they've eaten. Um, they don't typically eat as much fruit as people would assume. They eat more of the leafy greens, so lots of trees and plants, over 200 different species of uh, leaves and plants that they would eat in their native rainforest area. So here at the zoo, that's one of our main challenges, is to provide our gorilla troop with all of those same behaviors that they would be doing in the wild, but here at the zoo. So these are some uh, treats, what we would use for enrichment, some sunflower seeds, some almonds, whole almonds, and so we have all these devices here, and we'll fill them up with some little treats, and then the gorillas will have to work at getting these treats out of these bowls. We've, you can see we've melted this and formed a bit of a depression so that it makes it a little bit harder for them to, to sort of get it out because it'll settle here and they have to sort of pop it up to sort of shake it to come out. Then these are some other devices. Inside here we've added a little bit of challenging blockage for the, the nuts. So they really have to shake it, as do I, to get them in there. There we go. Another really important uh, enrichment item for our gorillas is brows. Uh, we're lucky enough at our zoo to give our gorillas brows or some form of brows almost every day of the year, including winter. Um, and you can see here, there's not a lot of leaves on this brows. This is willow and apple, but our gorillas still love it. They'll strip the bark off of it and work at it as well. So uh, even in the winter, we're still able to give them that behavioral enrichment that uh, allows them to do what is most natural to them, which is forage. We also get a huge amount of tropical brows for our gorillas that our garden will take from inside the pavilion or uh, from any of our greenhouses here on site. This is a uh, Dracaena and uh, this is a tropical plant and so the gorillas also will enjoy this. They'll um, eat the leaves. They actually, it's funny when they eat the Dracaena, they eat all parts of the leaves except this one vein that comes down the, the leaf. So it's, they're very particular about how they eat their food items. So we give this, we'll give them brows probably two or three times a day in addition to their other forage items as well. So after they've eaten all of their uh, forage items that will be placed out here, uh, then they'll have a bit of a siesta and have a rest. And then it'll be time shortly after that in a couple of hours for their next meal or their next feed. So uh, that's part of uh, a really important part of their day here at the zoo and a part, important part of our day as well.